Hello and welcome back to Icarus Lobster Tales. I am Scott, and today we're here with episode 3, Tales of Arise. If you haven't caught up on 1 and 2, go ahead and check the link in the description down below. I'm sure if you're watching episode 3, you'll enjoy episode 1 and 2. Let's see, last episode we got into our battles, and now we made it to our area where we have to like infiltrate uh, Senior Balsef's like, place. I did actually die last episode. Uh, let's fight this thing. Let's see if I can remember how to fight. It's gonna be entertaining. Uh, what is it like? Listen, this. How do you? How do you dodge again? Oh, not that way. Oh no. Can you do it faster so I can get some experience? Am I alive? I won't rest until I'm the best I can be. T still nope. To be on par with I'm dead. I'm still dead. All right. Can you use arts to heal me? Art screen. Yes, I think she can use her arts to heal me. First aid. There we go. Back. The Lord. All right. I, can't I can't remember. How to dodge. We'll figure it out next time. I can't remember. It's been a little bit since I recorded playing. But also, Iron Mask's got no experience because he's died at the end of each of those battles. Let's stop a moment to catch our breath. Oh, a campfire. Dark Souls, here I we go. Worked up a sweat. Speak for yourself. What do you want, a medal? Yeah, kind it of. It doesn't look like we're being followed. Fail to grab these rare moments of quiet when you can. You'll end up regretting it later. It's a good point. A uh, very boss. good point. He's the boss? What? Whew, it's warm in my basement. It's sweaty down here. I'm sweaty down here? <clears throat> Zephyr and Iron Mask. Camping out. Restores HP and CP. You can watch skits that you previously missed. Normally, we should take turns standing guard. Huh. But this first time, I'll watch over things, so you two can rest easy. Sounds good. Let's just rest, and let's get to it. A master core, huh? Oh, I guess so. Now I see. So that's why Balsep's cronies were so desperate to catch her. Is that what it's called? The jewel in her chest? You didn't know about it? Oh, right. You don't remember a damn thing, do you? Yeah. Fair yeah, enough. Fair enough. I guess it's time to fill you back in. Tell me. You ever wonder why we Danans are made to work ourselves to the bone, day in, day out? No. Well, when you put it like that, I always just assumed we were mining resources for them. Then don't you think it'd be quicker if they used all that high-powered tech they have? Why go to all because the trouble? Because you are the resources. Listen, what the Renans are really after isn't resources or minerals. It's astral energy. Oh, never mind. I was thinking uh, back at Tales of Symphonia where the, the humans were literally turned into x -fears. They're harvesting the astral energy that sleeps inside all matter in life forms. Oh, holy smokes. Maybe I was right. It the same way they have for the past 300 years, using us Danans as mere siphons. Pretty similar, I think. Right. They have machines for minerals, but extracting from Danans requires spirit cores. Any astral energy collected passes through a spirit vessel on its way to being stored in a master core. Okay. Huh. But why go to the trouble of collecting all this energy in the first place? Do they really need all that juice just to use astral arts? It determines the sovereign. The sovereign. The sovereign. Is that the Renan ruler? Um, maybe. Exactly. Five lords, each doing whatever it takes to gather All as right. much guys. I hope you're doing good. And store it in their master I'm excited to play uh, this game here, so I'm paying attention in on the story. The their contest is Even the though I'm sure there's going to be twists and turns more than uh, a, a roller coaster. Contest, as they call it, is held every decade or so. A decade. That's so a lot. You see, the master cores are the receptacles in which the lords store their power. And we Danans are sacrificed, so the Renans can choose their new ruler. Yep. That's insane! You're telling me that's what our people have been dying for this whole time? Relax, hero. You're not the only one who's bent out of shape about the whole thing. I like how he calls him hero. It's funny. I laugh. I cry. 
There are two things that I haven't been able to get my head around yet. Looks like it's a story episode, ladies what and gentlemen. What would a Renin have stealing a Master Core? And what's the deal with that blazing sword? Hmm. I think Indeed. the sword is a physical manifestation of the Master Core's astral energy. As for why it took the shape of a sword, well, I don't know any more than you do. Honest. <laughs> and that stuff about needing your permission to use it? What was that about? I'm the only one of us who can control the Master Core to some extent. Apparently With not. We need to adjust the flow of astral energy. The sword can't take a physical form. What do you want out of this? You may be one of them, but you don't strike me as the ruthless oppressor type. Oh, man. I'm going to take down all of the lords. Yes. All right, let's do it. Stop chit chatting. Let's go fight. Never thought I'd say this, but I like the cut of your jib, Renan. Excuse me? Very the well. what? As far as we're concerned, the struggle continues either way. And with that sword on our side, our chances of victory just increased. A jib that is, of course, is a sail. We can count the the front you. most sail on a boat. Fine by me. All right, let's after get all, going. It sounds like we're after the same thing anyway. Yada, yada, yada. Keep talking. I... Honestly, I'm still a little confused by all this. Yeah, me too. Let's just go. But if it's a choice between this or going back to being a slave... Then I choose to fight. Does not seem like a choice, my friend. Then it's settled. Together we'll overthrow the Renin Lords. And first up on that chopping block is Balsef, the wild beast. <laughs> the way they pronounce that is just not right. They had to have known it sounds awfully like something different. Alright. Oh! Oh? Oh? Where did they all go? They left you alone. Okay, so now we know there's a ticking time bomb inside her or something like that. That is a very pleasant you've been healed sound. You've had a full night's rest. We have another secret hideout in Ulzebek, not far from here. We should be able to meet up with our comrades there. Go to Uzbek. Oh, look at those sparklies. Are these items? They better be. Collect. We should oh. be able to eat this. Whenever you find some, make sure to grab it. It's edible, huh? Good to know. Definitely. Descend. Should I have done this? We're gonna find out. This is taking like a half an hour. Pop do do pop do 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 Can I swim? Carp DM. Sage. I know what it is. It increases something HP or attack. One of the two. It is an herb. Commonly found in Tales games that helps you with your statistics. Now let's climb. Oh, I can't climb faster. I should have done that. Hold on, can I get. It looked like a little cavern there. It's not. Let's go. 183 stars. Nope. Probably meters, miles. Footsteps. Footsteps? Something easy. An apple gel. Oh, that looks spiky. That is one enormous stray. I don't Whoa. think we can take it right Giant now. Giant Zugulus. They roam around certain areas. Very hard to fight, but you can get rare items and lots of SP. We've almost made it to Ulzebek. Mushroom. Alright, don't go up there because I can't fight that thing. All right, level seven armadillo. All right. Did he really just say, "Guess we got to roll with it"? Nice. 
Nice. Punched him in the booty. Oh, and we killed it. Everything's Let's go. Up. Everything's coming up, Zephyr. He got sick. He's got food poisoning. And he's letting everybody know, Everything's coming up, Zephyr. All right, let's fight more. I see sparkly things. Let's do this. Normally, I don't pick on the weak. What's not going to plan? Our work is done here. Let's move. I'm right behind you. Alright, let's get this shiny thing. We're mining this. Oh, Parlasek stone. I sense a strange power from it. We should gather as many as we can find. It's not a bad idea. Alright, there's some more stuff down here. What's this? Orange gel. Upgrades SP, TP. I won't forgive you. I'm only getting started. You're surrounded. Just stay calm. You're not giving up now, are you? No. I refuse to let it end like this. That's what I want to hear. Raise your sword. Here I come. It's over. All right, getting used to the combat. Um, wasn't doing great with it earlier, apparently. Is there more than this? What's the jump button? Nope. Reminiscing. All right, this is a skit. We're gonna read skits because it's the first time I played this Didn't game. Did anyone ever tell you it's rude to stare? Oh. I know I already asked you this. But are you sure we haven't met somewhere before? You probably have. What's so hard to understand? I'm Renan, you're Danon. There's no way. Besides, I'm from Lenigus. Lenigus is how it's pronounced. Wherever you were before you lost your memory, we've never crossed paths. That is probably not true. Lenigus. If I know anything you about these the kinds of games. Lenigus that's up in the sky? I've heard it called the Renan's Castle, but I never imagined people actually lived up there. Hmm. Well then. Where did you think we all lived? Didn't Don't you be see so the sassy. Holy smokes. This lady's no and good. Stay away that? from her, Iron Man. Well, the current contest started seven years ago, so... Then I wouldn't remember. Because <laughs> you remember other things. Do you remember? About a year, give or take. That's how long ago Doc found me. One year. Then no. I'm sorry, but there really is no way we could have met. Guess not. I guess not. Okay, uh, I feel like I can get inside of this thing. I can get inside of this thing. Let's not jump. Let's not jump. Let's not jump. Go to Uzbek. Oh, jump is B. Okay. B. I don't think we got anything special over here. Okay. What about under the bridge? There's some fire. Alright, we got nothing. We're going to Ooze Black. Let's do this. Ooze Black. Nothing else. Open the doors. The Reddins. People of Reddins stock. That's all I can read. That's okay. That is alright. Oh, I like the little rhythm here. It sounds like people are pickaxing. And hoeing. That is not like an activity that I'm used to, but okay, they are people. using hoes Set. on dirt. Uzebek. Uzebek. No sign of any Renin guardsmen. Isn't that cool? The Renins aren't as populous as the Danins. Probably figure stationing guards in a place like this would be a waste of precious manpower. So this is where the next safe house is? Let's do it. Let's find someone else in our party. The last place they think to look for enemies is on their own doorstep. All right. That is, assuming anyone actually made it here before us. Maybe. Zephyr. Oh, hey, look, it's this guy. Looks like we needn't have worried. Come on. We were worried for like a second. 
It's funny. Head to the Crimson Crown's hideout. Hey, what's up? Oh, so you're the new recruit that Zephyr brought in, eh? Yeah, that's me. Interesting. I didn't expect it to be the one and only Iron Mask of all people. Wow. Anyway, there's a lot I need to probably fill you in on. Is there anything you want to know? What is this place? Yep. This is Ulzbek. It's a den and enclave that plenty of others in this realm, unlike Mosgul, which is mainly a mining area, this mostly produces food and other daily essentials. The Bright Eyes rarely show their faces here, which is why we made it our headquarters. Is there anything else you want to know? What's the situation? Our friends have made it back from the old Zion mine. Unfortunately, not everyone made it out of the air alive. Oh. Anything else you want to know? Am I really that famous? I do want to know this one. It is confusing me. Why are you so surprised? Of course you're famous, tough guy. Hard for people not to notice you wearing that mask of yours. And if that's not enough, you're always going to be out of your way to help. You're always going out of your way to help people and make life less miserable. It's no wonder people talk about you. What kind, with that kind of reputation, I say you definitely belong with the Crimson Crows. Anything else? No, I'm good. Thanks for talking, though. I appreciate your time, lady. Boom. Examine. What's this oh, here? I got an apple gel. Word to Big Bird. This lady looks sad. These chickens just laid their eggs in those damn red eyes. They took every last egg. They couldn't spare a single one. Chicken tender. Oh, my God. <laughs> Somebody who watches chickens is called a chicken tender. This is like the greatest moment of my life. <laughs> Whew. Oh, Don and woman, not as cool as a chicken tender. I hope those armored soldiers don't stick around here either, and they leave just like they did in Mosgul. school. Sounds like there was an explosion along the tracks. Did the Crimson Crows do that? Okay, that chicken tender had me in stitches. So I've been thinking of joining up with the Crimson Crows. You with them? What can you do? Your body is so weak. Okay. That's an awful lady. I can still fight. I have to. It's for our kids. To give them a future, you've got to understand. I know, but you're a weakling. Wano, 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 wano. Climbing up here. Go faster. Oh, look at all these people. They are so sad. I'm short on both supplies and manpower over here. I guess I've got no choice but to ask the Crimson Crows for help again. Jump. The wastelands are ahead, inhabited by nothing but zoogles for miles. Phew, business, I'd stay far away. Uh, these injuries should heal eventually. And when they do, I'm going to send them back to Moscow. I doubt I'm going to make it out of there alive this time. Rope! Climb endless ladder. Another person to talk to. Sounds like there's a bit of ruckus close by. Did something happen? I don't know what's going on around here. Long as they don't make my life any harder. I don't give a hoot. It's been long and hard enough struggle making this to my age. These words are coming out of my mouth. They're somewhat close enough to what she's saying. My creaky old body can't take much more. Is this an old man? After working with my hands all, all my life, I can't hardly see nothing with these old eyes anymore. Neat. Woo. Oh, hey, what's up? I'm out on patrol. Zephyr's orders. You can never be careful when dealing with the bright eyes. If any of us sense a whiff of trouble, all we have to do is give the signal. Everyone hides immediately. Okay. I've talked to a lot of people. Let's go see what... I'm glad you're here. Get inside. Okay. Get inside. Zephyr, you made it. Got it. See, I told you there's no way Zephyr would have kicked the bucket. Fine, you were right. So, what's the plan? Well, we've got an ace up our sleeve and the enemies in disarray. I say we strike while the iron's hot. While the iron mask is hot. So we're finally going head to head with Balsef. With Balsef. <laughs> That's right. We can't afford to mess this up. It's now or never. Then now it is. We've all been waiting for this day for To have them long. pronounce it Balsef and have them pronounce it Balsef? I don't know. I don't know. It sounds different. In the meantime. Yeah. You two need to do something about your outfits. Probably. 
Uh, he's got an iron mask. There's nothing you can change. It's like, oh, he's wearing a red shirt. Iron mask had a blue shirt on. Just the thing for your size. <laughs> Stay right there, okay? Ta-da! I told you, it fits like a dream. Okay, okay. Cool outfit for Iron Mask. I like it, but she's still wearing a dress I'm that looks... I'm afraid we don't have any Renan clothing. I could find you some Danon outfits. Ooh, she's not wearing Danon outfits. She needs but to. But something tells me you'd rather pass. Is this really that important? In case you need reminding, I'm here because our interests overlapped. Nothing more. Mm. At no point did I say I'd given up being a Renan. Now, now, let's play nice. How about you ask Nate and see what he says? Nate? He's our one-stop shop for info around here. Okay. With any luck, Nate was the guy that let me inside the building. Something. My uh, cable is pulling on something. Ocean blue. Battle garb. Zephyr left my party. Speak to Nate. This was Nate, right? Nope. Where's Nate? Don't they a star Nate? Oh, there's a star over there. Jump. 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 Okay. Hello, Nath. Nathaniel. Nath, we need your help. Ah, oh, damn. <laughs> the manpower huh? Help, huh? What kind? Is it urgent? Well, no, not exactly. Well, in that case, would you mind helping me out with something first? The work's really piled up we'll see. here. Do I have to go what kill something? What would you like us to do? Anything you can manage. Oh, no one cares about okay. us That's why what can I do? Anything. Just do something. Take care of each other. <laughs> Give me a task to do, Nate. Check in with that guy over there thanks. For details of what needs doing. And I appreciate it. Now loading. You see anybody around here who could use our help? We can't chase after every little thing. No, but we're going to do some menial chores while we're here. Oh, I thought he was gonna read it. You could say that. Didn't didn't think he'd send over the iron mask himself though. Is that a bright eyes with you? Are you sure we can really trust her? Oh, sigh, big sigh. She's on our side. Zephyr can vouch mm -hmm. for her. If Zephyr's good for her, yeah, let's do this. I didn't I skipped it. I skipped it. Eh, what the hell? Name's Dyron. I'm the one who runs this lodge. This is a lodge, but we already have our own beds. <laughs> <laughs> we don't need sleep and straw and rock hard dirt around here. The Crimson Crows have their fair share of folks who are either knocking on this door or can otherwise move around openly. This is what this place is for, to give people a place to rest up properly before they head off to fight. Everybody needs rest. If you don't rest, you can't hope to fight for the Bright Eyes. Or fighting against the Bright Eyes. I guess. Makes sense. What do you want us to do? I need your help to haul in some cargo. I have some friends who are on their way to collect it from their hideout in Zion Mine. It's really such a good idea after the random snuff that placed out. These are valuable items. People risk their lives. Okay, should be down in the sand of the ravine at this point. Meet up with them and help bring Got the supplies it. back. You're welcome to use these facilities if you need to start quest. Let's do this. Let's go on a little quest. Sub quests. Do I have to do these? I'm kind of like a main story guy in like the second no playthrough. The Crimson Crows were so active. You sound pretty thrilled by that. Thrilled? Maybe. But I'll settle for hopeful. We know now. But not everyone is rolling over for the Renans. I'm usually like a second playthrough side quest kind of guy. And the first playthrough is just like run through the main story. But I'll, I'll do a side quest here. Alright, let's fight these guys. I won't forgive you! You're more. No escape, rising wyvern, mirage, all these fun things. This could be useful. Hard bone. Alright, I wonder if I eat wheat, does it replenish health? 
Or is there a stamina that you need to have food for or something? Uh, let's check it out, actually. Menu. Items. Consumables. Okay, so no, I don't. I'm just going to use this right now. Running in the sage. Here we go. Oh, these guys are dead. All dead. What? They're all dead? Soldiers. That's how. <laughs> he thought they were sleeping, and I said they're all dead. Uh, Iron Mask. Sorry, I keep yeah, skipping things. Dyron sent me to help. Hang in there. I'm so glad you made it. In the bushes over there. You hang on. Sion, do something. It's no use. <laughs> he was not dead, Shion. <laughs> They've killed so many of us, and it's still not enough. They won't be satisfied until they've wiped us all out like pests. Like pests. Uh, he mentioned something about those bushes. We should check them. Is this a cooking pot? If I had to guess, he put it... <laughs> Sorry, I'm skipping this. I don't know why. So even though <laughs> he knew he like, was Like, honestly, dying, my brain's like, it's a sub, sub story, sub quest, side quest. We don't need to watch this. Somebody would come for it. <sighs> I guess you think it's stupid getting killed over a silly trinket, huh? You know what? It's not smart getting Clearly killed he over. Clearly, risked his life for something he believed in. I would never mock someone for that. However, it will be up to us to figure out the purpose behind his dying act. Weird. We'll make sure it wasn't in vain. If nothing else, this proves that the Renans can be outsmarted. Yes, because he hid a stove thing in a bush. You carry out your will. And we better get going. <sighs> we don't know when those soldiers might be back. Okay. I'm sorry. Did we get this thing? So this is what it means to fight the Renans. Sounds like you're kind of scared to me. Of course I am. But if I'm gonna die one way or another, I'd rather go down fighting. Rather go down fighting. All right. That side quest is finito, and I'm not doing any more side quests. It's stupid. I'm collecting mushrooms because they were right there. There's some wheat down there I'm not going to go get. <sighs> Alright, let's go give this to Byron. All right, we got this jug for you. So nobody made it, huh? I'm sorry, we arrived a little sooner. We could have, hey, these things happen. It hurts, but this is the world we live in. That was a weird accent. I'll take care of what you brought back. It's the only way we can respect this act. Uh -huh. was When's daddy coming home? Oh, that's this guy's kid. Hmm. Not yet, sweetie. Your dad's gone away for a while. Don't lie to me. He's dead, isn't he? <laughs> Well, I guess when you're a kid in this kind of world, death isn't as uh, shocking, maybe. I know that when grown-ups look sad and say someone's gone, they always mean they're dead. Daddy always warned me that this might happen. One day he told me to stay strong and be brave. <laughs> oh no, now she's going to cry. <laughs> this isn't right. Poor kid shouldn't have to be dragged into our messes. Let's report back to Nath and get ready to fight. Quest complete. We made it. Under Gaul and 200 SP. Skill panel. I don't know what a skill panel is. Iron Mask Rebellious Spark is a title? Skill. After a perfect evade or perfect guard, press RB to trigger an immediate counter attack. Deal? Titles. Yep, it was a title. All right. Skill panel. Skip this stuff. Can I spend points? Um, severing wind. Mid-air evasion. Uh, let's do stardust. That sounds fun. We'll do this one. All right. <sighs> System. Save. Guys, thank you so much for episode three of Tales of Arise. If you want more, make sure you drop a like and come back next time for episode four. I will see you there and then whenever that may be. Have a wonderful rest of your day, ladies and gentlemen.